What's that song? The uh do 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 That song hot. I'm about to make, make a remix. Stay woke do, 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 do. Christian sleeping. No for real though. Don't you close your eyes. Yo, we're talking they should they should make a remix to that, a gospel remix. Like put me on the track, cause the church be sleep sometimes. I'm just saying, y'all gotta wake up. Stay woke. Hello everybody and welcome back to the lifestyle where I am honored to do life with you. My name is Chanel and we are here with another video for you guys. By the way, I know I have one of this Amazon shirt, but this video is not sponsored by Amazon, even though it should be. Amazon, I'm here anytime you want to reach out. <laughs> Now, I don't know if you guys remember last week me saying how one day I just really felt like God was going to have me do the not so fun videos, the not so lighthearted videos and kind of share something that's on my heart to give to you all. And I think that day might be today. <laughs> Today, God just really started dropping stuff on my heart. And from that came a tweet. And the tweet said, If you are too afraid to ask the Lord to show you what you need to change or give up in your life, no matter what it is, that's a problem. If you pray that prayer and he shows you and you don't take action to change or give that thing up, that's a problem. I posted this post and from there, God just started downloading and downloading and downloading and like birthing a word inside of me. So here goes nothing. I don't know who this word is for and it may be for everybody, but God is really saying in the season, now is not the time to be deceived. You don't want to end up being the one saying, Lord, Lord, did I do this in your name? Did I do that in your name? Did I do that in your name? That verse refers to believers. You got to stop thinking that just because you believe that you will automatically inherit the kingdom of God. Do not be deceived. You're in a dangerous place the moment you start thinking, oh, I got it all together or I got it all figured out. Or even if you know your flaw field, but your constant prayer isn't, Lord, show me myself show me where I need to change show me what I need to give up show me what I may be linked up with that is not of God show me where there's an open door um, that I have show me where I'm giving the enemy a foothold strengthen me show me what I need to stay away from show me what I need to run to uh, Lord if there's anything that's in me that's not like you take it away renew me renew my mind renew my spirit um cleanse me lord transform me make me more like you if that's not your constant prayer you might want to do a heart check it's not about being perfect or having it all together but it's about the purity of your heart if that isn't your disposition then you must ask yourself what is the position of my heart you must remain vigilant the Bible says that in the last days, false Christs and false prophets will arise. And if possible, even the very elect will be deceived. And are we not in that current time? I see pastors, leaders, and people that we look at and think so highly of that are falling off like flies and being sucked into deception and idolatry. I see the same people claiming to be so woke, so sleep. The Lord is coming back and the time to get right is now. The time to ask him questions and to seek for answers through his word is now. The time for self-examination and self-denial are now. Strongholds are real. Attachment is real. Selfish desire is real. But God was real way before any of that and he is realer than any of it today. Dying to your flesh is painful and bloody, but I can guarantee you that it hurts way less than the death that Christ died for you. So with that being said, I want to challenge all of you to a heart check. Comment below in the comment section if you will commit to doing some self-examining throughout this next week. Go ahead and like this video, subscribe to my channel, turn on your notifications so you don't miss a video, and as always, share, share, share this video. I know that it will help someone. And don't forget, we're just like you. We just think different.